Assalamu alaikum guys. Today in this practical video, I will guide you for some important information related this RCC slip. Guys, you can see clearly, they did some common mistakes in the construction of this slip. So let me point out those mistakes the front of you, practically. Guys, you can see, main bars and distribution bars. Spacing is 5 by 6 inches. Dia is same, which is 12 millimeter or half inch for both way main bars and distribution bars guys this is double mesh you can see here guys also they provided the lapping length on wrong place so this is not the place to provide lapping length as you can see if they provide the lapping length so they should provide the lapping alternately but you can see this is in same point Actually guys, this is the place because on the top of beam, they provided lapping length. So this is not the place to provide lapping length. This is the place to resist negative bending moment. For that, we will provide bent up bar or extra steel rods. So instead of extra steel rods or bent up bar, they provided here lapping length. So this is the danger place because we have maximum shear stresses as well as also uh, as well as here now guys you can see this is the junction between beam and column at this place they should provide extra steel rods but i don't know they are just wasting their time as well as their money you can see the spacing so now the spacing is about about 10 inches here on this side if you see this side so this is six by six inches five by six inches so everything is wrong guys you can see the beam depth of the beam is 14 inches width is 12 inches with concrete cover now guys you can see they provided 60 rods for this column so also this is the wrong design for column this is four story commercial building let me show you the other beam on the top of this beam you can also see they provided the lapping length so guys i don't know why uh, they provided lapping length on each beam look here guys so the length of lapping is about five feet on one side four uh, three feet on the other side this is two feet you can see here also they provided here the lapping length so more than 50 percent lapping length you will see in this construction of slab so this is the big mistakes guys you can see also on the top of this they provide they should provide the the other bars because the spacing is maximum which is about 10 inches you can see the beam and this top beam the stirrup spacing is wrong hooks are uh, provided in 90 degree but it should be provided on 135 degree let me show you the other beam guys you can see on the top of this beam also they provided the lapping length i don't know why if you see on this place they also provide it also at the middle of the uh, slab they provided here guys you can see now uh, this chaja is cantilever so in this chaja they also provided the lapping length i don't know why they provided three steel rods at the bottom three at the top for this beam two are side bars actually at the top they should provide uh, minimum bars compared to its bottom because concrete is strong and compression but it's weak in tension so therefore in tension zone we should provide more numbers compared to its top guys you can see the junction you can't see any extra steel rods to resist negative bending moment guys you can see clearly